So I'm currently running a bath at 8 a.m. on a Sunday. <laughs> I have a face mask on. This is um, one of the Colbert MD face masks. Piglet's yapping at me. So it's Sunday today and I'm up really early because the clocks have gone back. So it's actually nine o'clock. Like, I just looked at my watch. I was like, it's nine, it's eight, it's seven. I don't even know what time it is. Um, it's actually eight o'clock, like legit time, but it feels like nine. And this one is not happy because Mike, no. has, oh yeah, we saw that. Mike's gone for his Sunday run. And because our friend Dodge is staying, she's, he's taken both Spaniels and left just Piglet. And she's very, very upset about it that she has to stay with me. It's girly pamper time. Basically, <laughs> okay, big, okay. The reason why I'm running a bath, I don't normally have a bath shush, in the morning, is that my back has been out um, again. I didn't vlog yesterday because I basically spent the whole day like in pain on the sofa. So I'm having a bath this morning to try and kind of ease it up before the start of the day because I rolled over this morning. You know when you have that moment, anyone that's ever hurt their back will know. You roll over and you're like, oh, oh no. <laughs> Um, so I'm having a bath and put a face mask on because these just arrived a new pack from the lovely girls at Colbert MD and they're like my favourites so thought so why not I'm having a bath in the morning why not do a face mask as well and Piglet is not entirely sure what I've got on my face are you pig mm. oh grumpy are you grumpy oh yeah you grumpy <laughs> So today, I'm in the process of packing up all of the stuff that I'm going to be selling on my Depop. Piglet is not helping me. She's being a big hindrance. She's still not over the fact that the boys have left and taken the other dogs with them. Um, yeah, an update on the Depop thing. I think the shop's going to go live on Wednesday. Um, I'm really excited about it. I've actually, like got so much stuff to sell. I've been taking all the pictures. Um, I took all of the accessory pictures, which these are like all the shoes, yesterday. Um, and... It was actually, that's how I did my back in again because we were like halfway through taking the pictures first thing in the morning and I like bent over to undo a buckle on my shoe and was like, ah. So we literally spent the next hour and a half taking the rest of the pictures. What are you doing? Um, with like Mike like lifting me up and doing all the buckles up on my shoes. It was a bit of a pain in the ass. But anyway, um, I'm packing these up and then later today we're doing all of the outfit pictures. So um, yeah, it's quite a long winded process, but I'm really excited because hopefully we're going to make lots of money for charity and yeah, I just like ever since I was a little kid, I've always been into like selling stuff and I'd like, I don't know why, I just really like it. So um, and I'm getting really organized and putting all the shoes in like little individual plastic bags and everything, the ones that don't have boxes and blah, 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 piglets being a stalker. Sunday breakfast courtesy of MDF. A little someone is trying to sneak some sausage under there. Stealth sausage. Treacle. Tech. She's like, oh, I'm tired. She's like, what? So Mike and I have just taken all of the pictures. It's a lot of pictures. And I'm packing everything up. I've got my pile of clothes here, ready to go. And two whole boxes. So this box is for the clothes. And then I've just packed up all of the shoes and handbags in there. It's quite a lot of stuff. So, like two hours later, I have finished boxing, bagging, tagging, photo editing, everything, and my Depop shop is ready, almost. I've just sent all of the pictures over, because the Depop team are helping me to actually like run everything and posting it out. And here are some of the pictures, if you guys are interested in checking it out. There's a lot of stuff on there. So, I'm in the van with Dodge. <laughs> We're waiting for Mike who's going to be driving. We've borrowed a van off my dad because we're moving Mike's motorbike over to his parents' house. And uh, in case you haven't, or in case you're wondering why I've got such a red nose, I was just itching my nose like this. <laughs> and Dodge was like, that's a really good look. You should show everyone that. <laughs> so I did. Joe's like, didn't think that I would show that, but it's a good nose scratching technique, guys. Check it out. Does anyone else have any interesting nose scratching techniques? She's showing that one off. That was the better one. It's the best one. <laughs> Come on, Mike, hurry up. We're hungry. <laughs> so we're going to the pub where we actually went last Sunday in my vlog, and I told Dodge about the pie, and then we told him that it also frequently runs out. So we're happy, hoping, oh my God, they have the best pie. Libby had it last time, but Libby's one was a bit skinny. Normally it's like 
like that fat. <laughs> it's normally pretty amazing. I want some pie. Oh, I'm really excited for you to try it. I don't know what I'm gonna have. Mike just trod in dog poo, hence he's a little bit slow. Hello. Hello. <laughs> How is your, uh, how's your foot? Dog pooey. <laughs> I sold him a dummy, guys. There's no pie on the menu. Yeah, I'm, I'm not in focus, but he's looking really sad right now. It, right it really now. doesn't like him, look. <laughs> Someone managed to secure a sneaky pie. Guys, Small this is actually the best pie in the world. Small portion of roast. <laughs> Woo! Gendy. Yep. Slight food envy going on here. <laughs> I'm just heating up some pork lentil and kale soup for dinner that Mike bought the other day. Ready-made Waitrose number, but just a little bit of dinner tonight because we had pretty big lunch at the pub. I'm also having a couple of these salted nuts, which I have to say, I wasn't very impressed when Mike bought these because they have pecans in them, and pecans are normally sweet, but actually these are pretty good salted. I have to say, the hazelnuts definitely let the side down. Something about salted hazelnuts, they're just better off in the form of Nutella for me, hazelnuts. Like hazelnuts and chocolate is great, salty hazelnuts, mm, not so much. Bit of a random one guys, but I used these for the first time last night and they are honestly the best face wipes I've tried in ages. They're the Garnier Micellar oil infused cleansing wipes, and I don't normally like oily um, micellar water, but these are amazing. And I'm actually going to try. I got sent the micellar water as well as these. I'm going to try the micellar water now, which I automatically kind of just discounted because I don't usually like oil uh, makeup remover. But the wipes are so good. So I've just given myself a proper little Sunday night facial, and I wanted to show you guys what I use this evening. Like I just said, I use these. Um, oil micellar wipes to take off my makeup then i used this cleanser which is called benefit clean by cosmetics um which is actually i haven't used this too much this got recommended to me by um my facialist friend marie um and i do like it but i haven't used it enough to have like a proper opinion on it then i used one of these which tarty got me into actually they're called reloxin lift um face masks they are freaking amazing they come in these individual sachets and you like jiggle them about for like 30 seconds to like activate them um and then you put them on your face and they honestly just like tighten brighten just make everything look and feel amazing and then i've also used this which is the keels nightly refining micro peel concentrate it's a really nice kind of overnight um peel treatments um, which helps to like resurface and just leave you with kind of like nice glowing skin in the morning I've used this a few times before and I really like it actually and then I haven't used this yet But I'm about to pop it on um, this is the temple spa eye truffle eye cream Which I've been using for the past few weeks and really liking and There's my little Sunday night routine I didn't finish my vlog because I'm a terrible person and I fell asleep whilst researching my Christmas gift guides Which you guys might be happy to hear about I don't know do you like Christmas gift guides? I'm now looking for breakfast the fridge is looking rather dilapidated. Apart, unless you want to drink beer for breakfast, then you're fine. Oh, There's one There's egg. A couple of eggs, actually. Oh, where's the other egg? Right behind it. <gasps> oh, yeah, Three. two eggs. That is going to be it for today, guys. Bye from me and Mike. Bad vlogger. Goodbye.